this is Raina. Thank you for joining me on my crochet channel. In this video, uh, we will make the harvest doily. And uh, this one is easy to make. Um, so besides some basic crochet stitches, we'll do uh, some picots and clusters. And uh, I do recommend it for uh, beginners as well to um, work with the crochet thread. And um, it came out quite big, this one. It's almost 20 inches in uh, diameter and it has 24 rounds. And let's uh, see which thread I'm using. Uh, using Aunt Lydia's crochet thread size 10. Uh, this color is called pumpkin. Uh, it is a category lace size zero. Uh, one ball has 350 yards in it. And one ball is enough. And my crochet hook is size 1.75 millimeters. And let's get started. So check out the link in the video description box. Uh, and you'll find the full written pattern uh, link there and to start we'll make the slip knot and first chain eight five six seven eight then slip stitch in the first chain to make the ring and we can start the first round. It is going to be 16 double crochet stitches in the ring. Starts with three chains and this counts as the first double crochet. So now double crochet 15 more in the ring. And finish the round with a slip stitch in that third beginning chain. Round two is going to be 32 triple crochets, so two stitches in each, starting with four chains. This counts as the first triple crochet. Now yarn over twice, inserting hook in that same stitch. Make your first triple crochet. And now make triple crochet in the next and another one in the same stitch. So two in each stitch. Total 32. And round three starts with four chains. This counts as first double crochet and one chain. Then double crochet in the next stitch. Chain one. And again double crochet in the next stitch. Chain one. And repeat. And finish the round, slip stitch in third chain, beginning chain. And for the round four, first slip stitch in this first chain space, we're going to make three double crochet clusters. And the beginning one is with two chains, then yarn over, start your First double crochet, pull through first two loops, keep last two loops and hook, yarn over, start the second one, pull through first two loops. Now you have three loops and hook, pull through all of them. That's the beginning cluster. Chain three, 
between each cluster. In the next change space, we'll make the regular cluster yarn over. Start the first double crochet, don't finish. Start the second, don't finish. Only pull through first two loops. Start the third one, don't finish. And now you have four loops and hook, pull through all of them. Chain three. And again, in the next chain space. And repeat all around. And to finish this round after the last cluster, instead of three chains, I'm going to chain one and then half double crochet in top of that first cluster. Yarn over, insert hook here, pull up a loop and pull through all loops. So we are in the middle of the space to start the next round and you'll see it curves here at this point because we have a lot of these clusters but that's okay we uh, will need to block the finished doily anyways and now uh, round five chain one and single crochet in this space beginning space we created chain three and then single crochet in the next three chain space, chain three, single crochet in the next space, chain three. And finish this round same way as the last one instead of last three chains chain one and then half double crochet yarn over insert hook in that beginning single crochet stitch pull up loop pull through all loops and hook and now we start round six uh, starts with seven chains one two three four five six seven this counts as first double crochet and four chains and now double crochet in the next space chain four double crochet in the next space chain four and this repeats And to finish this round, chain four and find the third beginning chain slip stitch in it. And round uh, seven, first slip stitch in the next chain space. And we're just going to make four double crochets in each chain space. The first one start with three chains that's the first double crochet and double crochet now three more in here total four skipping this stitch go into the next space make four double crochets in here and again in the next space Four double crochets. And repeat. And 
and finish this round slip stitch in third beginning chain and to start round eight i will first uh, slip stitch back into this uh, space here between first and last double crochet because i need to start uh, from here and first we're going to uh, chain four this counts as the beginning triple crochet then yarn over twice and make a triple crochet in that next space between double crochet so skipping these four insert hook here triple crochet then chain six four five six and we're going to make uh, trip two triple crochets together yarn over twice and the first leg always goes in that same space where you did the last triple crochet so start your first one don't finish leave last two loops and hook yarn over twice and then insert hook in that next space skipping four double crochets and also don't finish that one when you have three loops on hook pull through all of them two tri uh, triple crochets together chain six four five six again yarn over twice insert hook in the same space where the last triple crochet was don't finish it yarn over twice insert hook in the next space don't finish the stitch pull through three loops on hook chain six five six and repeat Let's do the last uh, two triple crochets together, starting in this space, and the second one goes now in that beginning space. And to finish the round, chain two, not six, and then make a triple crochet uh, in top of this beginning triangle here. So we can start round nine from here and and round nine starts with three chains this is the first double crochet and now double crochet three more next to it in the same space so we have four chain three and then go into the next chain space make four double crochets and four chain three and repeat four double crochets in the next space chain three and I finished this round with a slip stitch in the third beginning chain and now round 10 is exactly the same chain three for the first double crochet now you just uh, double crochet one in each previous round double crochet so again four then you chain three and then double crochet one in each next four
chain three. And I finished this round same way with a slip stitch in third beginning chain. And now round 11. Uh, starts with uh, also four double crochets. First make three chains for the first double crochet, then double crochet one in each next. Now chain three and single crochet in this three chain space in the next one here and chain three more now make four double crochets one in each next and then chain three and now go into the next double crochet make four here And now again we're gonna do this part so chain three single crochet in the chain space chain three and again four double crochets And now repeat, make uh, three chains and then go into the next the four stitches. And then you do again three chains, single crochet, three chains. Finish the round with slip stitch in third beginning chain. Round 12 starts the same chain three double crochet one in each next three and here in this part first uh, chain three and now we're going to do two double crochets together the first one going in the first three chain space pull through first two loops don't finish and the second one going in the next chain space pull through first two loops and now three loops pull through all of them two together and chain three then double crochet one in each next four and here just chain three and again double crochet four chain three two double crochets together chain three double crochet four chain three and repeat and row 13 round 13 is the same chain three make three double crochets chain three and again two double crochets together first one goes in first chain space second goes in second chain space 
chain three and double crochet four. And here chain three and start over with double crochets. Round 14, start with two chains and a double crochet in the next stitch. So this is the beginning two double crochets together. Then double crochet one in each next two. And here we do the same chain three, two together. chain three, then double crochet one in each next two, and the last two, two together. So start the first one, don't finish, start the second one, and then pull through three loops. And here chain seven three four five six and seven and repeat first you do two together then one in each next two chain three And then again two together here one in each next two okay chain three one in each next two two together And chain seven, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Repeat and finish this round. Last seven chains, slip stitch in top of that beginning, two double crochets together. And round 15 starts the same again, chain two and make double crochet in the next stitch this is the beginning two double crochets together and then double crochet in the next stitch and this part is the same chain three two double crochets together first goes here and the second one in the next space chain three And here, double crochet one, and then two together in the next two. Start first, start second, pull through three loops. And here now, uh, chain four. And now we're gonna do triple crochet and find the fourth chain one two three four insert hook in here make triple crochet and then make a second one in that same chain so two triple crochets chain four and now here it repeats first we need to do two double crochets together then one double crochet here chain three two together chain three 
one double crochet and then two together and then again chain four make two triple crochets in that fourth chain chain four and repeat and to finish this round instead of uh, last four chains we're going to make a triple crochet inserting hook in top of that beginning two together and make the triple crochet here and starting now um, uh, round 16 first chain four and then triple crochet and I'm inserting hook here in the base here of that four chains then chain four and here again we're going to do two together so first one goes here and second one goes in that next stitch in the next chain space make two double crochets one two then double crochet in top of the two together and two double crochets in the next space And then here again two together now chain four and we're going to make two triple crochets in that first stitch one and two Then chain five, five, and two triple crochets in the next stitch, and two, and chain four, two, three, four. Here we do the same first two together, two double crochets in chain space one in top of the, the two together here and two double crochets in a chain space and here again two together and then you repeat this part four chains two triple crochets five chains two triple crochets four chains and finish this round last five chains going to slip stitch in fourth beginning chain here and round 17 starts from here uh, four chains this is the first uh, triple crochet then make triple crochet in that same stitch and triple crochet in that next stitch chain four and here we start again with two double crochets together so I start the first and start the second pull through three loops and then three double crochets one in each next three and in the last two, two together. Start first, start second, chain four, triple crochet in that first stitch here, and then two triple crochets in that second. Now 
here chain three and two triple crochets find the middle chain one two three the third and in it make two triple crochets chain three and in here in the first one make two triple crochets and then one in that next and chain four repeat two double crochets together three double crochets two together and chain four and then you repeat this part and finish this round last the three chains slip stitch in fourth beginning chain and round 18 starts the same chain four then triple crochet in the next stitch and also one in the next so three here, chain four, and here in these five stitches we're going to make five double crochets together. So we start the first one in the first stitch, don't finish, start the second in the second stitch, start third in third stitch, start fourth in fourth stitch and start fifth in fifth stitch and now we have four, five, six loops on hook and pull through all of them from here chain four and triple crochet one in each next three first here second and the third now chain three and make two triple crochets in that first triple crochet stitch one and two then chain five and now triple crochet two in that next stitch one and two then chain three and triple crochet one in each next three stitch then chain four and now this repeats again here we do the five double crochets together and then chain four and then two three triple crochets three chains two triple crochets five chains two triple crochets three chains three triple crochets four chains and finished this round also with a slip stitch in fourth beginning chain and round 19 starts the same make four chains for the first triple crochet then triple crochet one in each next two to have three here next chain three and now skipping this part go into the next triple crochet and make one in each 
next three then chain three and we need three triple crochets here as well so I'm going to make two in the first stitch one two and then one in the next then chain three and now two triple crochets here in the middle chain one two three the third one make two and chain three and here again we need three triple crochets so make one in the first and two in that second and chain three and here just triple crochet one in each stitch and here it repeats now chain three skip this go into the next triple crochet and here we just make three one in each so this part three chains three triple crochets three chains two triple crochets three chains three triple crochets three chains three triple crochets also finished this round with a slip stitch in fourth beginning chain and now round 20 chain four for first triple crochet now we're go going to make two triple crochets together in next two stitches start the first one don't finish start the second one and pull through three loops now we're going to skip the chain and again make two triple crochets together in the next two here start the first and start the second pull through three loops and just triple crochet now in that next stitch here Now chain four and make three triple crochets here. Chain three make two triple crochets in that first stitch here then chain five and two triple crochets in that second one here chain three and three triple crochets here next uh, chain four and there's going to be this beginning part here so in the first one make one triple crochet 
then two together in the next two stitches first and second again two together in the next two stitches and one triple crochet in that next stitch and then it repeats uh, four chains three triple crochets three chains two triple crochets five chains two triple crochets three chains three triple crochets and four chains and finish this round last four chains slip stitch again in the beginning fourth chain and round 21 first make three chains and then we're going to make triple crochets together so we'll start the second one and insert hook in the top of that two together of last round and don't finish start this next one insert hook in that next two together and don't finish and start the next one insert hook in that last stitch of this group here and now you have four loops on hook pull through all of them so this is the beginning one then chain four three triple crochets here chain three here we also need three so I'm going to make two triple crochets in the first stitch And one in the next. Chain three. Now two triple crochets in the middle chain. Count the third. Two triple crochets in here. And chain three. Here again, we need three, I'm making one in the next stitch and two in the next. Then chain three. And three triple crochets here. And then uh, chain four. And we're going to do four triple crochets together in here. So the first one goes in the first stitch, don't finish, second one in here, third, and the fourth, and now I have five loops on hook pulled through all of them. And from here it repeats uh, chain four three triple crochets, three chains, three triple crochets, three chains, two triple crochets, three chains, three triples, three chains, three triples, four chains, and again four triple crochets together. And finish the round, last four chains, slip stitch in top of that beginning 
four triple crochets together to start round 22 first we need to uh, slip stitch in each next four chains one two three and four also slip stitch in that next triple crochet and now we're gonna do three triple crochets together the beginning one is uh, three chains start the triple crochet in next stitch don't finish start triple crochet in that third stitch and pull through three loops next chain three three triple crochets here chain three one triple crochet in the next stitch and here chain four and one triple crochet in the next chain three here three triple crochets chain three and in here we're gonna do three triple crochets together start first start second and start third and pull through four loops Next chain seven, three, four, five, six, seven. Skipping this here, go into these next three triple crochets, make three together. And repeat uh, three chains, three triple crochets, three chains, one triple crochet, four chains, one triple crochet, three chains, three triple crochets, three chains, three triple crochets together, and seven chains, and again three together. And to finish this round my last seven chains slip stitch in top of that beginning three together to start round 23 first slip stitch in next three chains also slip stitch in the next triple crochet chain four we do three triple crochets here so that's the second and third next chain four triple crochet in that next stitch chain one now triple crochet in that uh, chain space chain one triple crochet in the same space we'll do four of these here in the space chain one between third triple crochet chain one and fourth 
chain one now make one more triple crochet in the next stitch and then chain four and here again we do three And here now chain five skipping this three together find the middle chain one two three the fourth and single crochet in it that's the seven chain space and chain five again skipping this three together we start over two three triple crochets here and then here chain four one triple crochet in the next stitch then four go into that chain space and chain one between each and one again in that in this stitch and chain four after three triple crochets chain five single crochet chain five and finished with last five chains and slip stitch in fourth beginning chain and now the last round 24 starts with three triple crochets together so we chain three then start triple crochet in the next stitch and start one in the next and pull through three loops on hook and next we chain three we're going to make picots on this uh, round so chain three more so total six here and slip stitch in that third chain from the hook chain three more and now we're going to go into these one chain spaces make five three triple crochets together so skipping this go in this one chain space start first triple start second and third now you have four loops on hook pull through and between these we'll do again the same as here uh, chain three plus three total six and then slip stitch in third chain from hook for pico chain three more now to the next cluster in the next one chain space And again, chains and pico. Two, three, four, five, six. Slip stitch in third. And chain three. And the next.
I have to have five of these. We do one more time the chains and pico, chain six, five, six, slip stitch in third, chain three, and chain three. And now we're going to go into these stitches and make three triple crochets together. Start first in the first stitch, start second in the second stitch, and start third in the third. Pull through four loops. And again, chain six. Slip stitch in third chain from hook and chain three. And here we're skipping this part, go into these next uh, triple crochet stitches and make three together here. Now repeat to the first uh, six chains plus uh, a slip stitch for pico and three chains. And then do these uh, three triple crochets together in each chain one space. And you always do the chains and picos in between. And I'm done with my edge. I'm going to finish the last round. Just slip stitch in top of that beginning three together. And pass enough, cut off the thread. And as you see, it curls, it's wavy. So next thing I'm going to block my doily as usual um, I'm first going to make it uh, wet and then uh, stretch it out on my blocking mats uh, attach it with uh, pins and um, use some spray starch as well to give it some extra firm and nice shape and here are some uh, photos to show you how I block my doily Here's my finished doily. It looks great after blocking. It's quite big, doesn't really even fit my video screen here. Um, but as you saw uh, on those pre previous photos, uh, to block it, I put pins in each of these uh, edge uh, picots. And um, I hope you have fun making your own harvest doily. You will find written pattern on my blog and the link is also in the video description box. Thank you so much, much for watching and happy crocheting!